Hey everybody, it's Butcher from Level Up Tactical here today to talk to you about a nice 22 pistol, the MMP 22 Compact. Now the uh, 22 long rifle world is uh, is huge. I mean, every there's AR-15 in 22 caliber. There's almost every kind of firearm you can imagine: uh, AK-47s, AR-15s, uh, Thompsons, pistols, revolvers. You name it. There's probably one out there in 22 caliber. Uh, 22 long rifle. Now, uh, we were looking for, I was looking for uh, something that uh, I can take out to the range and, and just practice some fundamentals with and, and uh, you know, not break the bank by shooting, you know, blocks and blocks of uh, 40 Smith & Wesson or 9mm. Um, 22 caliber seems to be pretty uh, sourceable nowadays. So I uh, finally got into the market for one. Um, I ended up picking up the MMP 22 after some uh, some deliberation between that and the Ruger, which uh, a friend of mine also bought a Ruger, and I got to tell you, it is very nice. Uh, but for me, the 22, the MMP was uh, kind of where I wanted to be. Now the uh, this pistol you see here in front of you was purchased from JS Firearms in Leesburg, New Jersey. Uh, if you guys have a chance, check them out at www.jsfirearms.com. Uh, they have a lot of uh, items available uh, between uh, ammo, pistols, rifles, uh, and they're very affordably priced. So just definitely check them out. They're a great gun sh uh, great shop uh, for people to, to source products from. Now the M&P 22 uh, price point, I'm going to about between $350 to $400 depending on where you source it from. Uh, this pistol here uh, does have the threaded barrel on the front. Uh, Unfortunately, where I am at now, I'm probably not going to be able to get a uh, silencer for it, or suppressor, sorry. Uh, but uh, it was available, and, you know, it doesn't really make a difference to me. It's a, I th actually think it looks kind of neat uh, with the uh, threaded threaded uh, adapter on the tip. But uh, for the $350 to $400, you do get uh, two mags. You get the pistol and two mags. Uh, before we go any further, I do want to let everybody know there are no rounds in the magazines, and the chamber is empty. You can kind of see there, there's no mags, nothing. Gun is safe, okay? Uh, it is a polymer-based pistol, so the frame is polymer. Uh, the barrel is fixed uh, into the frame, I believe, and uh, the uh, full system is very nice. It's very com it's very comfortable, actually. Uh, now, the, the full-size version of this, I believe, is a one-to-one uh, -one match to the uh, M&P 9. So if you have an M&P 9 and you buy the full-size version of the uh, M&P 22, uh, you can actually go plinking back and forth and you'll have a pretty good, uh, you know, uh, feel comparison between the two pistols. So, you, you know, you'll, you'll be able to train really nice with it. Now, I was almost, almost bought a six-hour uh, Mosquito, but after doing a lot of research, you know, I, I just decided, you know what, the Mosquito probably wasn't for me. I am a huge six-hour fan, uh, uh, but, you know, this is... Uh, this is what ended up winning out for me here. Uh, it is nice. Um, comes with two mags. They are metal. Uh, they are Smith & Wesson's. They are... Uh, what are they? 10 round magazines. Uh, polymer base plate. They say MMP on the bottom. You can see that there. Um, it's a nice little... It's a nice pistol. I mean, I, I like it a lot. The, the slide locks back when the, when the mag's empty and there's no rounds in it. So you can release it. it. Does have a mag release there? I mean, I'm sorry. The mag release is right here. Uh, the slide release is up here. This is your takedown lever. It does have a safety. So when it's uh, when you don't have a mag in there, you can't pull the trigger anyway. But if you do have a mag in, the, in there and there's no round or there's a round in battery, here's your trigger pull. Okay, so it is pretty nice um, for the money. I definitely would tell people to get it. It does have some nice sights on it. Let's see if I can show it to you here real quick. Uh, big bright white uh, sight, three dot sights. Um, very easy to acquire your targets when moving back and forth. Um, I do like it. Uh, like I said, feel wise, it's a compact size, so it's a little smaller feel than everything else. It does have a nice little uh, cut in for your thumb here. Uh, it is polymer trigger. I feel like I almost feel like I could break it. Uh, but like I said, for what it is, it's a 22 pistol. It's not like you're using this for uh, duty or carry or home home defense. This is a t uh, basically a uh, uh, I want to say toy, but it feels like a toy, but, uh, it's a, it's a blinking pistol. You know, it's something to have a little bit of fun with when you're at the range. Uh, maybe introduce some young, young people to shooting. This is a great little pistol for it. Um, I do recommend it. Um, shot about, I would say there's, I've put probably, I don't know, 
about three, 4,000 rounds through this thing already since I bought it. Um, only had a couple failure to ejects. Um, and, and I've been shooting Remington Golden Bullet, uh, so, and we all know what that's like. So uh, I feel pretty fortunate that I've only had a few uh, failure to ejects. Uh, but, you know, it's, it cycles great. I mean, I, I do have this thing lubed up with uh, Fire Clean. Um, so, you know, I, I, I'm a fan of it. I know a lot of people don't like it, but I'm a fan of it. I haven't had any problems with it. So uh, it does work pretty well. Um, you know, here's a quick look. The M&P 22 Compact from Smith & Wesson. If you want one, go out and check it out. For 350 bucks and just say another $50, you can get a brick of 522 long rifle rounds and go out and spend a half a day shooting. <laughs> As always, everybody, uh, check us out on the web at www.leveluptactical.com. You can check us out on Facebook at www.facebook.com forward slash leveluptactical. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel here. We'll be posting more quick look videos as well as some in-depth reviews on different products, pistols, rifles. Uh, we'll also be posting some firearm trainings uh, videos that you can actually practice at home. Uh, you know, with, obviously with no rounds, no ammunition. Let's be uh, realistic people. But uh, check us out. As always, everybody, stay safe and shoot straight. Take care.